so our ui is done right now if i click on calculate age this will not calculate your age then why it is not calculating because we have to write the uh we have to write the function for it okay so let's start to write our function okay so where we have to go for writing the function is basically we let's jump to our code and uh after written okay after written let's uh uh, what we can do, uh, the initial logic is basically uh, whenever we are uh, putting the values, we have to get these inputs. Okay, so how can we get the input? This is a first step. So let's jump to the code, and here we here our input is so basically what we can do. We have to define two states variable first for getting the values also. Okay, so uh, above the return, we have to write uh, state values. Okay, const so i'm making uh, these states okay const birth date and uh, set birth date okay i'm pasting these state values okay so here first is birth date and set birth date so initially we uh, the birth date value is this one okay which is blank and uh, the second state we have right now age and set age so initially the age value is zero okay so after uh, adding the logic we have to update according to the set each okay so now let's write uh so this will uh let's go to the input value we have to write okay so here we are getting the uh, values from the inputs how can we get basically we have to write value and we are getting the values of birth date okay whatever the user is provided we have to get it here okay birth date okay so we have provided and we have also on on change function okay on change we have to update the uh, e targeted value so we have write it here as set birth uh, birth date okay and how can we define uh, how can we update the e targeted value just in the set age uh, birth date okay we have to update e dot target dot values okay uh, so we have updated uh, in that way so basically uh, let's uh, write the function for the calculate age simple what we can do is just basically we have to define an on click and uh, on on click we have to define a function like calculate age here calculate age as you can see in the terminal it says it is not defined let's define this calculate age function first and uh, where we have to write our, our logic so first i'm defining like const calculate age okay and we are making es6 function here okay we are using es6 function so how can we do that basically const the name of the function and uh, fat arrow function this is called we call it fat arrow function and here what we can do just define the today let's get the today's date okay and uh, is equal to new date okay with this function we can get the today's date okay in the next step what we can do just define birth date okay whatever the user uh, providing their birth date okay d t is equal to new date new date okay and here what we can do just pass the birth date value b i r t h d a t e okay birth date whatever we have provided here okay we you, you have to pass it here okay so we make two variables here first is today and birth date and date i have uh, you can make uh, another variable according to your choice okay so i make these two uh, variables right now let's uh, write the logic for it first what i can do is let age okay is equal to uh, today i'm just getting the today dot okay uh, get full day full year okay uh function minus uh birth date whatever we have provided here so let's copy it from here okay and just paste it okay that's it simple and uh here in birth date what we are uh, trying to do is basically getting the full year okay full year value okay now uh okay so till this point i hope you have cleared uh in the next step what we can do we have to define a difference okay month difference uh if you are getting uh, in the next step we are uh, getting the month difference values also 
okay so for now what we can do uh just let and let's update the set value first okay set age and uh, here the age value okay and uh, okay. age is assigned uh, but never used so here we have here we have assigned the age value okay so how can we set the values so we have to make a difference for it we have to define a difference so how can we write a uh, logic for it basically we have to define a month difference here okay suppose so here i'm getting the month difference and then uh okay so what we can do is basically uh that's if month difference is m o n t h the difference uh smaller than zero uh, or if the month difference is m o n t h plus equal to zero and today dot get date okay so which is smaller than smaller than birth date whatever you have provided so we have to write at this function over here okay so birth date dot get value then what we can do just we have to uh if the age value age is okay that's it okay now what we can do here we are setting the value of age any value but never used so successfully we have write uh, we have write all the logic for our age calculator let's set this value uh, set this age uh, to uh, to the left side okay uh, from here jsx we have to write Okay, so what we can do here in the we have to go to the left side, okay, left diff, and we have to update this value. Okay, how can we do that? Just basically, we just open a JSX for it. Okay, so how can we open a JSX for it? Basically, we have to open a JSX and then conditionally, uh, we have to render this conditionally. So, here if the age value uh, is greater than zero, then we have to render. What we have to render, we have to render uh, uh, basically we have to render the age value. Okay, then how can we write uh, dollar and then age value we have to write it here. Okay, otherwise if uh, the age value is uh, false, then we have to uh, do nothing. Okay, so uh, till this point, I hope you have cleared and uh, our error is also gone. Okay, so now let's check uh, the output. So suppose if I click on uh, one one and two two and uh, here I'm providing three three two three okay two three 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 and if I click on age so okay suppose if I click on one one okay so this will uh, gives a uh, age value okay so now uh, suppose if I try different here uh, different inputs here one 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 okay two zero 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 okay so if I click on calculate age and then this will give your uh, age in year so i hope till this point you have clear and you have a basic idea of how to uh, how to play with the conditional rendering and uh, how to update the values using use state so the next target we have to uh, when whenever we click on the reset button this value and this input field value will uh, uh, reset it okay so let's start